Hello, I'm Dean Karstens of Dean's N-Scale Trains, but today I'm not going to be talking about my trains. Instead, I'm going to be returning to the Ender 3 V3 SE, which I talked about a couple of months ago. Back in February, I showed you how to install this end of filament detector on the Ender 3 V3 SE. Today I'm going to show you how to change the filament when the end of filament kicks in and the filament runs out. And as always, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it.